I got married recently. It's going to be one year in two days. My family was really concerned when I was going to get married because they were worried that we would fight too much. When we were signing the contract at the courthouse, my dad was like, listen, we haven't signed papers, okay? He's a lawyer. We haven't signed papers, okay? We can just leave, all of us. <laughs> no one will do anything, okay? I'll protect you. Maybe we can do something, maybe get some insurance, yeah? Health insurance, better? And that was great advice, except he was talking to my husband at the time. <laughs> I'm like, Dad, whose side are you on, huh? He's like, oh my God, she heard us. Run, I'll protect you, just run, man. <laughs> but we don't fight as much as everybody thinks we would. It's because he's the exact opposite of me. See, he's Egyptian. <laughs> and these guys are human filters. Nothing gets to him. He's so peaceful, so calm, bad things just bounce right off. But of course, no marriage is free from fights, and we do fight about one thing. We have gamer fights. Both him and I are avid gamers, and when we play games, things get real. The biggest fight we had in the entire year of marriage was over a game of World of Warcraft. <laughs> Who plays World of Warcraft? Nerds. <laughs> so we're playing a game of World of Warcraft, and for those of you who don't know, it's a game where people play together online. We take it seriously, but it's not serious at all. And his role in the game is to be a healer, which means he keeps everybody alive. However, he's my husband, so his job is to keep me alive. <laughs> I know, it sounds a little unreasonable, but let's say your significant other works for Emirates. You expect f free airline tickets, no? Exactly, can you tell him he's right there? Do you see? This lady nodded, can you nod at him? <laughs> this one time him and I are playing World of Warcraft and he lets me die. Five times. safety check of Facebook for everyone involved. So I did the unthinkable. I rage quit. Which means I left mid-game while they were fighting and everybody died. So the calm Egyptian filter lost his mind. He kicked down the door and he's like, how could you leave me? <laughs> me? You let me bleed for two hours. You're being unreasonable. I'm doing too many things. Nothing is good enough for you. I'm your wife. I'm your priority. You're selfish. If you loved me, you would have let me die. <laughs> Our neighbors heard this and freaked out. <laughs> they're like, oh my God, the Jordanians next door, they're gonna kill each other. Someone's bleeding. Call security, man. <laughs> So they did call security. <laughs> security showed up at our doorstep and they wanted to take my husband away thinking there's some sort of marital abuse and I thought maybe I should let them. <laughs> he was like, Fie, uh, are you gonna tell them? What's, explain this. And I'm like, who needs a healer now? <laughs> Thank you everybody, thank you so much. <laughs>